This is data entry. But it's only part of the story. There's more to data entry than the key punch room. You may not have realized how much of data entry happens upstream before it reaches this room, or how much it may be costly. We didn't until we made a study of the number of customers. Here's what we found. Out of every dollar spent for data entry, 72 cents are spent outside the data processing department. Here's the way it breaks down. Of each dollar, data processing labor accounts for 12%. Equipment used for data entry, key punches and mark readers, a portion of the CPU, peripheral units, card readers, and about 11%. While cards, mailing costs, and so on account for another 5%. Total, about 28% in the data processing department. That means that for every dollar you spend here, you spend almost $3 on non-data entry labor costs. There's the cost of moving things. There's source recording, editing and coding, rewriting for worksheets, and again, the labor to transport piles of data and boxes of cards from here to there and back again. With growing information needs, more data is being generated, and most data is handled several times and, of course, moved several times. And what are the results? A high error rate for one thing, plus lost time with multiple handling in separate steps. And 72 cents out of every dollar spent in preparation before it ever gets to the key punch room. Of course, you need a central data entry location like this. But suppose you could also have the possibility of entering data at the source. One entry, and then directly into the computer by the people who have the correct information and the original documents. Distribution people, for example. Keeping track of product shipments, deliveries of parts, and warehouse inventories. People in accounts payable, or in purchasing, or accounts receivable, who may prefer to keep original documents for controls and to avoid loss in transit and who therefore have to encode worksheets from the originals to send to the key punch room. That means extra work here. And because the data goes through several hands, more chance for error. Or a branch office where a busy secretary or typist, in addition to all her regular work, may have to encode documents, orders or invoices or other information for the central office. She knows the original documents well, but encoding is a tedious extra job. Now it's possible to improve data entry in a central location and add decentralized and remote data entry. But it requires a systems approach and a system to make it work. This is the new IBM 3740 data entry system. A family of products, integrated to work together. The basic equipment is the 3742 dual data entry station, a high production two operator station that can replace key punch equipment. It brings clean, quiet key entry into central locations. And it does away with cards forever. With a familiar keyboard and a helpful visual display, operators find it easy to make the transition to this new equipment. And they appreciate the quiet. There is also a single station version, the 3741, used as a control station or as a decentralized or remote terminal. Like the dual station, it doesn't use cards. 
Both record on a brand new compact magnetic medium, the IBM diskette. It looks like a 45 RPM record, but it can hold as much information as 3,080 column cards. Flexible, reusable, mailable, this magnetic diskette is the complete medium for data entry. It provides unlimited storage of data and programs. And diskettes are interchangeable from one machine to another. And this is the third member of the system family, the 3747, the unit that converts data from both stations onto computer-readable half-inch tape. And any job can be run with one pass through the 3747. Things here are not only quieter and cleaner, but productivity is on the way up. Together, this system can supply all your batch data entry requirements. On 3742 stations, two operators share a single control unit, and each one has a data display. Each display unit has three 40-character lines, one for machine status and two for data display. She can get hash totals, do some editing, and formatting. The same keyboard is used for entering data and for verifying. Also, if one machine should be down, only two operators would not be producing. The other stations would keep on operating. But most of your data entry costs occur before the data even reaches this room. And we can attack that 72% of costs by eliminating redundant steps in data entry with the versatile 3741. In the accounting department, for example, the accounts payable function is made simpler because invoices can be kept in the department and simply marked up for entry directly from here. The workload is less, the chance of error is reduced, and the same people can do the job. Anyone can be easily trained to make fast, accurate entries. Or in the distribution area, where information vital to the company originates, the 3741 can provide efficient data entry promptly. The people here know the information, and the operator guidance features directs each entry in plain language, right on the face of the tube. The diskette can be carried to the computer center or communicated directly through teleprocessing. And the optional printer, printing out at 40 characters per second, can produce hard copy of any data. Best of all, you can adapt the 3740 system to your business, not the other way around. For example, you can place this terminal even in a remote branch office. It makes everyone's job easier. She can enter all the local data, customer orders or daily sales figures, without writing worksheets. And when she's finished, she can transmit in batch with the teleprocessing feature. The terminal can even print out computer-generated invoices. But there are other advantages for the branch manager. He has a local database on diskette to supply up-to-date information to help him run the office. A list of orders, new customers, accounts payable, dollar volume, salesman's performance. This and more is available to him. The equipment allows him to interchange data and massage it to get essential business information. As we have said, the 3740 is a system. It can do a lot to improve data entry here. Just consider the ease of handling the medium. A box of cards weighs 11 pounds. One diskette weighs an ounce and a half. This system can improve the efficiency of data entry, not just in a central location, but wherever data originates. As your DP manager will agree, correct data is essential for data processing. With data entry stations in decentral and remote locations, you can ensure greater accuracy with fewer steps, less waste time, and less cost. 
The application user can have more than the new responsibility of data entry. He can have a teleprocessing link to the central location to communicate with another 3741, to half-inch tape with a data converter, or directly to the central computer. And all communication can move both ways in batch. You can move in this direction a step at a time with an integrated system. But it requires top-level decisions. Only you and your colleagues can improve data entry at the source. Think about it.